children. This is a lesson in alley dock backing. As I've said before, the front axle here, this is the steer axle. Behind that on the truck, that is the drive axle. And on the back of the trailer, those are the tandems. Now, as you're making any sharp turns, your tandems are actually going to be a pivot point for the back of the trailer. The tail of the trailer is going to swing out and clip any items you have over on this side. Since you've got about 10 feet between the tandems and the tail of the trailer, you're going to swing out about at a maximum 10 feet. That's a really sharp turn, so you want to be 10 feet away from any obstacles. The truck width is actually about 10 feet, so you just need to make yourself one truck width away from the spot you're going for. The main pivot point between the truck and the trailer, the only pivot point, is the fifth wheel. So as you're setting up for your alley dock, you want to place the fifth wheel in the center of the spot you're going for. Here on this truck, I can see the fifth wheel is just in front of the drive axle. Mm -hmm. There it is. So with the fifth wheel at the center of the spot you're going for, you're going to want to turn your wheel all the way to the right. I right, make a 90 degree turn. Pointing the truck in the same direction of the spot that you're going for. It's our 90 degree, 90 degree turn right there. The next thing you want to do is turn the wheel all the way to the left. And go another 90 degrees to the left. There we go. So now the truck is pointing in the same direction as we were when we started. After that, you want to straighten your tires out, your steer tires, and then simply back straight up. Right now we are squaring the trailer, getting it lined up for the spot we want. Right before your tandems reach the far line of the spot we're going for, the close, the near line, we're going to want to turn the wheel to the left and get under the trailer. So we're all the way to the left right now. Starting to turn to the right a little bit more just to keep it in line. At this point, it's just a matter of straight line backing into the spot that we want. Lining the tandems up. Then the drives. And then last, the steer axle. <laughs> 